we finally have a brand new promo format. No more copy and paste in this new No Shave November promo. We're going to take a look at all the screenshots. So let's get on into it. Okay, so all of these screenshots are from KC stream to link to it. That stream will be in the description down below. As you can see, it is a brand new promo, No Shave November. We got a ton of sneak peeks and these are the first two masters that might drop um, in the game. There are four of them in total, 487 masters and there is a grand master later on. But basically one or two of them might drop on the first day and then more will come later on throughout the whole promo and we'll probably get like one every so often like we're getting with campaigns at the moment but in the promo as it were so maybe one every two days or something like that but we'll go through all the screenshots you got an 87 overall steve adams and 87 overall chris middleton then the grandmaster is that 89 overall james harden the beard as it were of course because linking to the theme of no shave november um, as you can see you're going to need to turn in four 87 overall no shave november masters to unlock the 89 james harden and James Harden will come towards the end of the promo, sort of like it will build up to him. Like we'll get two of the 87s, then maybe another 87, then another 87, and then finally that 89 overall Harden uh, towards the end of the Masters. Um, so you can't actually get them straight away because then it kind of stops people from just buying their way through the promo. You're going to have to play through it and it is a whole new format. So let's go on and take a look at the actual Storm Masters. As you can see, there are five 87 overall Storm Masters. I don't know whether these will come out straight away at the beginning of the promo or whether they'll drop later on in the promo. It just depends. You've got Jonathan Isaacs, you've got Kawhi Leonard, you've got Clay Thompson, you've got Carl Anthony Towns, and you've got Mike Conley over there. Looking really nice. And we'll go into their stats later on in the video. But this is what the map is looking like. And this is a whole new format. We haven't had a map like this before, I don't think. Um, as you can see, you've got No Shave November claim. So I'm guessing you'll claim like a starting master. I don't know exactly what it's going to be like for that one. But when we do get this promo, I will be doing a massive promo breakdown. So make sure you're subscribed with notifications turned on because you don't want to miss that. Then going on to the next one, as you can see, this is the Blitz event. Play the Blitz event each day to earn beard oil points and beard combs. Now this is looking like it will refresh every single day. You're going to get 20 a day, which is pretty good. And out of this, you'll get beard oil points and beard combs. Then we'll go on to what each of them two mean. As you can see, those are the extra events. And these ones, you're going to need beard combs to actually play through on the blitz events you're going to get oil points and then you also get the combs as well and the combs are used to play these events over here and it's looking like there are two ones you can play you can try and get a token over there it's looking like and you will also try and get some more extra points over there as well now it's really difficult to work out exactly what you're going to get from these events just from these screenshots but my guess is you'll get some extra tokens because they do look similar to some tokens later on in the promo which i'll go on to maybe that's a chance pack and then up here you'll probably get some guaranteed beard oil points over there but we'll have to wait and see like i said and then at the bottom as you can see you will get chances at 76 to 80 overall players and those 87 overall masters and we'll go on to them later on as you can see there are milestones now there are two milestones which is a little bit different because normally we just get one set of milestones whereas this time we get two similar to how the life pass works and we'll go on to that as well earning beard oil points will help you through those milestones so you can get up to those 87 overall in the set and then there's our extra ones there are premium milestones um, which we'll go into as well which you can only unlock by purchasing the premium milestone offer in the store now this doesn't actually replace like the vip event as you can see that's probably over there as it's locked as it normally is but it does sort of introduce a new idea like we have with life pass like you've got premium side and you've also got that no money spent side it's kind of similar to that in the format of this promo with those milestones there's also a leaderboard which is looking like it's going to refresh every single day but these are the no money spent milestones over here so what you're going to get is you're going to get 76 to 80 overall packs you're going to get three of them on the first milestone and you're going to keep going through and you will get some of these tokens over there now those tokens are going to be valuable in the sets to get an 87 overall masters but as you can see you're going to get two um in the first set of the milestones and then an extra two in the second set of the milestones if that makes sense but that is the first milestone and that is the no money spent size so in total you get four of those beard tokens and you'll get some extra players just in those milestones alone again you could probably get them from other places we just don't know yet and then the premium milestone you're gonna have to pay for with real money and you'll get some extra beard tokens it's looking like so you get some extra beard tokens as well as 80 overall packs over there so you get some extra players from that one and that's kind of an upgrade from the no money spent one obviously as you can see you'll get anywhere between 76 and 80 overall players whereas this one in the premium one you're going to get guaranteed 80 overall players so that kind of distinguishes between the two and then also you'll get an extra beard token there so in total you get another four from the premium milestone so that puts you up to eight in total if you're looking at the no money spent milestones and the premium milestones and then finally you've got an 86 overall player over there which we'll go on to now as you can see in the sets with those players the lower overall ones 76 to 80 overall players you're going to need five of them to get an undefined amount of beard or points we just don't know what that is i'm guessing it'll probably be anywhere between 3000 2000 4000 we just don't know but that's just a guess i don't know for certain and as you can see you can also trade in 76 to 84 overall players you're going to need four of them for an 80 overall pack instead so this is looking like you're going to trade in any four of them to get yourself a guaranteed 
80 overall crack. And the reason for this set over here is for this one over here, because as you can see, you're gonna need one of each different overall. And this one, you could probably only do once. I don't think you could do it multiple times, because as you can see on these ones, these are repeatable um, by that symbol over there. Same with this one, but this one over here isn't repeatable. So I'm guessing this one, you can just do once and get yourself that 7,000 beard oil points, but you're gonna need each different overall um, of player once. So you're gonna need 176 overall one, 177 overall, all the way through to 80 overall. So that's basically why this set is here. I don't know whether it's a select pack it could be, but I doubt it um, based off of all this stuff. I don't think it's going to be a select pack. I think you're just going to get a random 80 overall. So say you get unlucky and you don't get an 80 overall, you get a 76, 77, 78, 79, but you don't get that 80 overall. You can then stick in four random players to then get yourself that 80 overall and get yourself those 7,000 uh, points over there. And then these are the sets. You're going to need 77 overall version of them, and then you're going to need four extra players and then one of those power beard tokens over there. So that is going to get you the 82 overall player, and that is the same for each of them. So you've got Trey Young, you got Jalen Brown, you got Chris Middleton, and that's Steven Adams as well. Then going on from 82 to 87, you're going to need the 82 overall version of the player. You're going to need 10 of the 76 to 80 overall players. You're going to need five of those 80 overall players. So that's where that set comes in handy again, this one over here, because then you can get those 80 overall masters pretty easily over there. And then you're going to need five of them and one power beard token over there. So if we judge by the normally spent milestones alone, like I said, you can get four of those power beard tokens. So that puts you up to at least two 87 overall masters. Now, if you purchase the premium milestones, you will get all four of them, but I don't know exactly how else you can get these power bid tokens. And then what you need to do is with all of those 487 overall masters, you can get that 89 overall playstyle select uh, James Harden over there, which is pretty nice in the store. You've obviously got your money packs. You can purchase some select packs for the 80 overalls. You can get some extra packs for 76 to 80 overall players. You can get some extra beard oil points. You can get some NBA cash and stamina, all of that stuff that we usually get. You can also buy some extra power beard tokens and those 87 overall store masters, like I said. I don't know exactly when they will come out, um, but as you can see, you will get some extra packs. And this one over here does look like it's unlimited, but it could have a limit on it. We just don't know. It's kind of like a boom or bust pack, but you get a 5% chance at those 76 to 80 overall players, as well as those extra points over there. Then there's also um, these coin packs. So 10 of these, every single day, you're going to get a drop of beard oil. I don't know exactly how much that is equal to. It could be a random amount. It could be 200. It could be 300. It could be 400. It could even be 1,000. I just don't know exactly what it's going to be like, but you can purchase that 10K a day, 10 of those, so that probably be 100K a day if you're going by that. And then there's also a watch ad or spend credits five days every single day to get yourself 100 beard oil points just from that. So that is all the stuff to do with the promo, like the actual map, the events, the sets, and the store. Now we'll take a look at some of the player stats. As you can see, this is the player that you'll get at the end of the premium milestone, and he is a power small forward over here, 86 overall. He's got some decent stats, not the best, not the worst. He's kind of got some all around stats. He's got an 85 mid range shot 75 three-point shot fairly low rebounding stats though and an 81 dunking and an 82 layup on the defensive end again nothing too special 78 block 86 still is pretty good the playmaking side is a little bit better but he's nothing too amazing when it comes to the stats compared to some of these other cards like this Trey Young this Trey Young is looking really nice he's a finesse point guard he's got 90 speed 62 dunking although he's a point guard he's got an 88 layup which is really nice 88 three-point shot which is really really nice and an 87 mid-range shot, rebounding fairly low. Though he is just a point guard. Playmaking side, again, really nice. Defensive side is not going to be the best because he is a point guard, like I've said, but he is looking like a really, really nice card. And then you've got Jalen Brown. Again, he is a power shooting guard over there. He's got some decent stats as well. 84 mid-range. His three-point shot could be a little bit higher, but it's at 79. He's got 81 dunking, 88 layup, 70s for the rebounding stats, which is okay. It's not the best, it's not the worst. Playmaking side, again, is decent. Defensive end is pretty good as well. It's kind of like an all-around card, nothing too special when it comes to stats. Chris Middleton, again, is like another one of those cards where it's well-balanced. There's nothing really standing out for him, but he's a finesse small forward. Again, 90 mid-range shot, which is probably the best stat he's got. 80 dunking, 89 layup, 81 three-point shot, which is pretty good. Offensive and defensive rebounding sitting at 70 and 73. Defensive end, again, nothing too special over there. you got 75 still and a 68 block over there. Then looking at Steven Adams, he is a strategic center. He's looking like a pretty decent center. 86 offensive rebounding and 89 defensive rebounding, which is pretty good. 84 dunking and 83 layup. His three-point shot is really low, but he is a center, so he's going to be in the paint, getting those rebounds, getting those dunks. He's got a 77 mid-range shot, which is pretty decent. Defensive end, he's got an 87 block and a 76 steal. Box out is pretty good as well. 
and all of those defensive stats on the left hand side are pretty good as well as even the passing accuracy for a center is 76 which is pretty nice then you got mike conley he is a strategic point guard his three point shot is an 86 he's got an 83 mid-range shot 81 dunking 82 layup offensive and defensive stats are in the high 60s which is okay for a point guard then you've got a 73 block and an 81 steal which is pretty good passing accuracy is an 87 so playmaking and the shooting side is going to be pretty decent with this card if you're a strategic player and he is actually one of the storm masters so yeah carrying on with these storm masters the stats you got clay thompson hopefully he's going to be pretty good when he returns i'm hearing that he might return a little bit earlier than christmas day which he was expected to return then but maybe he comes back a little bit earlier anyway it's going to be really exciting to see when he does actually play and how good he's going to be starting off because the Warriors at the moment we're playing really well but aside from that you got 87 overall clay thompson he is a finesse shooting guard the finesse players like myself we've got a really nice with this promo we've got a lot of good players we can try and get especially in the store there are some pretty good masters if you are looking to spend the extra money in the cash he's got a 93 point shot which is pretty good 88 mid-range 81 dunking 84 layup 85 speed and agility which is pretty good then going on to the defensive end 74 block 81 steal his passing accuracy is good his playmaking is decent but mainly when you've got a clay thompson card he's looking to knock the three ball down and of course that mid-range shot as well which is pretty good then going on to Kawhi leonard he is a finesse small forward like i said a lot of finesse players in this actual event but most of them are in the store um so if you've got the cash you got the money you can look towards getting these a 90 dunking 80 layup 80 scoring with contact and 90 mid-range shot 83 point shot 80 offensive rebounding 86 defensive rebounding his stats are looking really nice pretty much all of them in the 80s and 90s with a couple of 70s here and there 80 block 81 still is pretty good as well so on the offensive side he is looking really nice defensive wise not as good but is still pretty good on the defensive end compared to the other players then you got jonathan isaacs he's a power power forward he's got some decent stats as you can see over there nothing too special when it comes to those um, and defensive wise he's a little bit better he's got 86 block and an 86 still as well Carl Anthony Towns, a finesse center. Like I said, really good finesse players. 88 offensive rebounding, 87 defensive rebounding, 92 dunking, 85 layup. Pretty good over there. Defensive stats, again, he's looking like really good card. He's got really high box out stats with 87 and 90. And then he's got some decent playmaking stats as well. The block is only a 72, which could be a little bit better for a center. And then finally, James Harden, play style selects. You got him at 89 overall. His stats are looking really nice. Um, 88 speed, 90 first step, 85 dunking, 90 layup, 89 three point shot, 80 six mid-range shot is pretty good over there playmaking side again 91 passing accuracy 89 court vision 66 block and 68 steal though he is mainly going to be shooting the ball and playmaking getting those assists in which are pretty nice so that's all the screenshots that we did get for the brand new no shave november promo again like i said it is a brand new format let me know in the comment section down below what you think of this promo do you think it'll be a good one do you not think it's a good one uh, leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already and i'll see you guys in the next one peace